Here's what's making news now around Indiana. Brought to you by Chapman Heating, Air Conditioning and Plumbing. The man for all seasons, Chapman. ChapmanHeating.com. Well, a popular Hendricks County brew pub is expanded to downtown Indianapolis in a familiar location off the cultural trail. Brewlink Brew Pub downtown opened this week just in time for March Madness. And as our Mary Rachel Redmond reports, whether you're looking for a wide array of craft beers or a host of unique cocktails, it's surprisingly the menu that may have you coming back for more. You may recognize 714 North Capitol as the former home of 2D Brewing, but there's a brand new tenant in town that has craft beer connoisseurs and even the most fickle of foodies talking. We're going to be a unique fit for downtown Indy because I think from a brewery perspective, I mean, we really, really focus on the beer. You really focus on the beverages and you really want to have a good time with that. We want to stay outside the box with the options. It's different from other places because we're so unique with the recipes that we have, you know, peanut butter in one, we have salted caramel in one, blueberry donut, we have bacon in one right now. And speaking of bacon, the menu at Brew Inc. is far from what you'd expect when you picture your run-of-the-mill bar fare. Quite the opposite, in fact. Not everyone, you know, focuses on the food. It's more of an afterthought, and we don't want that to be the case. We didn't want to be confused with the bar. We're, we're a brew pub. Um, the food, we want to stand out. The key to Brew Link's mouth-watering cuisine? It's the sauces. One of the bartenders said it best. Uh, it either needs to have sauce, cheese, or gravy on it, <laughs> and, and you're going to have a great menu. I think that's going to resonate with the Indiana uh, population. And, and the best thing about Brew Link, it's not just beer. We've also got brunch, and we're talking delicious eats. Mm. Every Saturday, every Sunday, 10 to 6, not only do you have food, you have delicious homemade cocktails. We paired up some of our uh, breakfast cocktails. I mean, honestly, we, ha we already have a donut beer, the Stone Cold Hazy. You might as well drink it as orange juice. It's perfect for that. And then we have some signature cocktails that we have on the menu, the Honey Badger, the Spicy Margarita, Brunch Punch, and this Hoosier Shake Up Lemonade. It tastes like the State Fair. And for those consuming adult beverages, this location right off the cultural trail may be not even a block, so. Go down walking with your family and stop in for lunch, so. Lunch, brunch. Yeah, brunch, cocktails, beer. beer. <laughs> and with big time college hoops just down the street, Brewlink says it's poised to provide one slam dunk of an experience. Um, we are going to do some fun stuff on a daily basis. And as we go into the weekend, uh, we're going to dedicate some new beers to the madness. We're not too far from where it's all going to happen. If they're looking for good food and, and good drinks before they head to the game, they, they should stop by here. But March Madness is just the beginning. The Brewing crew has plans to be a fixture in downtown Indy for years to come. I mean, we're looking for something that is going to be here for the next 20 years and just be a part of the city and the growth. I mean, we're, we're looking for everyone in the neighborhood to know that you can come hang out, whether it's your watering hole, whether it's your restaurant. We're going to be here for you the next 20 years uh, and something that hopefully we can pass down to our kids. Mary Rachel Redman, Inside Indiana Business.